Mike Morenci, a great guy, beloved by his players, but in the end, that was not enough to save his job. We've witnessed signs that the program is in a bit of a downward spiral, and without new leadership, we just didn't feel that we were going to get any better. So it was time to evaluate the program uh, at a time when the coach's contract was up, and it was the decision of all the people that were involved that it was time to make a change. A six-person committee was formed to evaluate Morency's job performance. Their recommendation to the school's administration cannot be disclosed, but it included job performance reviews submitted by Athletic Director Gord Grace and the football players, and information regarding fundraising and recruiting, among other things. In the end, it's all about money. Who has it and who doesn't? Windsor and Western have comparable recruiting budgets, but where Windsor falls short is on extra funding from the corporate world and from alumni. Some of the schools in the uh, OUA, uh, this comprises 100 to $125,000 of their, their total budget for their football team. Ours is nowhere near that, and it's because uh, many people feel that they just didn't want to give to the program in the state that it was in. And so are we looking forward to increased donations or increased support from corporate sponsors and alums? Yes, I, I, I would say we are, but that's not the fundamental reason for, for uh, changing uh, coaches at this particular time. It, uh, it's just one of many factors. Many factors that, under advice, Morenci was not able to comment on today. After 13 years, he is out, and the search for a replacement has begun.